And a very good evening to you. A big night ahead here at the San Siro, or as it's sometimes referred to, the Giuseppe Meazza Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. I'm directly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Inter, and they take on Empoli. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? The Inter starting lineup. Well, 3 5 2 is a good system only if you have top class wing backs because they have such a key role. They have to cover the whole length of the field, both with and without the ball. And the starting 11 for Empoli. Well, as you can see, they are very narrow in the attacking areas. So they have to be really clever with their combination play. But watch out for the fullbacks. They love to get forward to provide the width. An attractive match in store. And it's Inter who get the game underway. Damian Dzeko excellent defending Bandinelli Shimon Zhurkovsky Bici and well, they keep the ball moving he's trying to create something and no way through. Zhurkovsky. And options in the centre. Henderson. Keeping it moving dynamically. Promising possession, this. Can he give them the lead? Surely. Dangerous looking attack. Real defensive resilience. Given away by Inter. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, space for Inter in the wide position. And a timely intervention. And that was a very fine read. Now well, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri. Dzeko. Perisic. Wonderful chance. Wonderful block. Just the clearance that was called for. Dzeko crossing possibilities still level here but the pressure escalating and no joy as far as the cross was concerned but it did look dangerous for a moment but the keeper has it now 
Really fine initial touch. Petar Stojanovic. Ricci. Oh, moving it nicely. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So underway again here. Cannon to come up with the right answer. Ivan Perisic on the ball Bastoni Barella now do they mean business on this occasion this could square the game and that's exactly what has transpired now that could be a massive turning point and momentum is with them Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. And it's Alexis Sanchez threatening now. As teammates, he could play it too. But quick thinking defensively. Petar Stojanovic. Bandinelli. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Alexis Sanchez. It did look on for them, but not to be. Bandinelli. Pinamonti has it. Shimon Zhurkovsky. Still passing it around with authority. Bandinelli. Could play it in. Now delivering that deep cross. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Alexis Sanchez. Matteo Damian. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And he cuts inside. Tremendous block. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, that just hasn't happened today for Edin Dzeko, much to the surprise of many, Stuart. Well, he's almost been a bystander, Derek. You can see from the touch map, he just hasn't received the ball in the areas where he can do damage. That needs to change if they're to win here. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Bici. Shimon Zhurkovsky. Pinamonti has it. Bandinelli. And the referee blows for a foul. Alexis Sanchez 
And he's taken it away. Henderson. Now Fiamozzi. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Zhurkovsky. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. And a good tackle. Jacko. Promising sequence. Chalanolu. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Well, 2 1 it is here. And into the last 30 minutes now. Can they create something from here? And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. Substitution time it is. And now the delivery. Well, not quite the ideal delivery. Well, great read there to intercept. Brozovic. Charanolu. Now what can they do from here? Well, that's a well-timed pass. And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here's the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Goal! Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3 1 it is. Henderson. Or can they make one of these passes count? Shimon Zhurkovsky. And the ball with Stojanovic. Targets available. Cross comes in. Ivan Perisic. And teammates to play it to. Perisic with the ball. Throw-ins given. Brozovic. And here's Chalanolu. And still dangerous. And this is Brozovic. Body on the line. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Ricardo Fiamozzi. 
Ricci. Well, in the closing phase, and Inter really have seen everything go to plan for them in this match. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play, and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Charanolu. Martinez. Can he convert? And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. And we've entered the final five minutes. Ivan Perisic. Barella has it. Brozovic. They really look after the ball when they have it. Chananolu. Martinez. And a really good diving stop. Well, no escape. Not an immediate yellow card, but the referee deals with him now. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Who can he pick out? Plattered away. Brozovic. The outcome is a goal kick here. given away by Inter and that will do it the referee brings this match to an end Inter entitled to be happy about this because they picked up maximum points from this game what did you make of it? you're absolutely right Derek their attacking play was excellent full of energy and pace and the midfield completely dominated the game it was a great all-round performance what a really superb driven performance by Edin Dzeko here Stuart well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.